We are back. We're back at it with another haul video. I haven't been filming a lot of hauls in the last couple of months because I kind of wanted to clear out my wardrobe and just not buy too many more things before the new season came around. But it's kind of starting to get into like autumn or winter and I'm absolutely loving the clothes. I love puffers and kind of like warmer style clothing. And so today is going to be the first haul that we have done in a little bit and I am I'm really excited. So today's video is going to be a Rev Dolls haul. I've got this bunch of clothing from Rev Dolls here. Now, at first, I had no idea what Rev Dolls was. When I looked on their website, I thought that it was an only a plus size clothing website, but actually they do clothes ranging from size S all the way to XXXL, so such a wide range of clothing to suit so many different body types, which I thought was really nice. And I was really surprised to see that they stocked some really cute clothing for affordable prices, but I wasn't really too sure about the quality, what to expect, and I just because I'd never heard of them really before, I didn't have any idea what they were gonna be like, and I'd never seen any hauls on them. A little fur tickling my arm and I'm just like trying to speak trying to focus but also trying to find it like get off me so these items have been sent to me by Reb Dolls and they've also given me a cheeky little discount code uh, seven that coin the code is Sabrina 10 and I think it's for 10% off I will leave it down in the description bar for you guys as well and just that you know I don't make any money back from that it's just for you guys to save some money if you didn't want to buy any of the items for yourself now I have opened this big bag and I have worn a couple of the items in here already so I've got like a good idea of what I think of the pieces etc so let's just get into it not delay any further and I'm excited Ooh, my gosh <laughs> Death's worn this because yo it's inside out why am I so unprepared don't you just ever think to yourself like why is Sab so unprepared? The first item, if I can just like gather it and gather myself, is this really... Girl, you know, you know you want to join up with your friend. With your friend, you join your friend, you clip in. Is this really adorable dungarees, dungarees, pair of dungarees. They're just plain black. They've got the ripped knee details, which I really, really liked. They've got like a tight bottom, so they're like skinny jeans at the bottom, and then they literally are black all over. The hardware is like, uh, what do you call this color? It's that, oh, like steel. Mm. It's that dark gray kind of a color, so it doesn't stand out too much, which I really like. I don't like garish buttons and stuff. This is super cute. It's the perfect fit for me. I got it in a size S as I think I did with everything in the haul except for one jacket. So this is really cute. I've worn it a few times. I absolutely love it. I think for the price it's amazing quality and I would definitely recommend it. I really feel like it's hit or miss when it comes to dungarees. I personally find that a lot of the times they'll fit either on the legs or the top and not on one or the other. I do have like a fairly bigger bum. I'm like fairly curvaceous at the bottom. I've got bigger legs and upper body. So sometimes I get like a weird fit, but this is perfect. I really like it. My only thing that I would say is that I actually think that I asked for the camouflage one. So they had I think they had three or maybe just two, but it, definitely a camo and a black one. Um, but to be fair, I'm actually glad that I got the black. It goes with more. Um, the camo would have been cute too. It was just like something a little bit different. But I really like the black one. I don't have one like this. And I'm definitely be getting, going to be getting tons of wear out of this this autumn i love a little a little dungarees i don't know what to call them is it a dungaree set is this little pair of dungarees i love that pair with like a bright fun jumper knitwear it's a look so next up this so this is actually a funny story is i've got this denim jacket and you know when you really want something but they don't have it in your size so you're just like it's fine i'm just gonna get it anyway and make it work so that is what i did i ordered the size medium and I thought it would be too big because it is oversized anyway. And it kind of is too big. This is how it looks. It's super cute. I love the acid wash detail of him. <laughs> He's a boy. And 
the like rip details um it's got more rips than a lot of my other denim jackets which i love denim like i could just live in denim every single day but yeah it's super super cute and oversized i just uh, you know put it on now i really like it i've rolled up the sleeves as you guys can see here because that's one of the main issues that i get is that i do have um not like long arms so excuse me okay super cute it's such a nice and comfortable denim it's literally like it's really good quality and it feels so easy on some denim jackets you put on and they feel like super stiff i hate that one it's like freaking boxy and rigid and this ain't this just ain't it's really really cute i really love him and the funny thing is is that i tried it on and i was like the arms are so big and because a lot of my other jackets I would say I'm slightly more fitted, even if they are oversized, this is the most oversized one that I own. I was like, mm, this ain't gonna fit me, but I was like, that's weird. I'll ask Mike if maybe it can fit him. And literally, this jacket fits him. The arms are a little bit short, so he just rolls the arms up, but otherwise, they, it, this fits him, and he actually wore it to SW4. So, a little cheeky, we got like a little share item in the closet. But I really love this, um, and I think I'm just gonna leave it on now, because feeling super slinky and cute so yeah this is how the labels look by the way they're really big it says rep dolls unapologetic why could i not read unapologetic i do apologize <laughs> unapologetic fashion sizes 0 to 28 and then it says hey there i've been waiting for a body and yours is perfection let's make fashion magic together try me on why keep all the fun to yourself go ahead show the world what hashtag sexy for all means Love me, post me, tag me. That's super cute. I really, really like that. Um, and I feel like they're just encouraging body positivity, which I'm all about. So thank you, Rub Dolls. Rub, rub, rub Dolls. Rub Dolls? Rub Dolls. I wonder what that actually means. I think I need to ask them because I'm interested to know. Okay, this item is one that I was slightly more skeptical about. And I'll go into my explanations of why. And I wanted to order something that I thought was a risky item. You know, something that's... A little bit more challenging to get right and that could easily go wrong so basically it is this maxi dress and it is just like a what do you call this like i want to say a square a square neckline it goes in and then it just flares all the way to the bottom and then it's got two splits so there's like the center and so your legs fly right out and i ordered this to take with me to greece which I didn't end up wearing because I took a craft load of clothes, let's just be fair, and there wasn't room for all of them to be worn. That's what I'm trying to say. There was not enough days and too many outfits. So I think that this is really cute. Like the colours were so bright and I was like, it's not like anything I own. They're a little bit they're slightly garish compared to what I would want. It fits me well. It's a little bit low in the front, so just be conscious even if you are size small that if you have really small boobs it is going to come quite far down so you might need like a nice push-up bra or like a bikini underneath something like that so this you could get like your size or i guess you could size down depending on your bust area it's really really cute i do like it the only thing is the material is like that look at it it's stretchy it's like it's not a soft material, which is what I was hoping for. It's more of like, it reminds me of a swimsuit material. So, like, yeah, it literally, I think it literally is made out of swimsuit material. So, it's very heavy and it doesn't feel like bad quality, but I would have liked it if it was a little bit softer. Mm -hmm. I'm not fitting in the mood at the moment. Bobby, you don't have to show your face. Did you wear this jacket to SW4? Yes, I did. Yeah, you did. It's for boys and girls. Sharing, sharing, sharing items since, not since 93, because that would be really weird because I was a baby. Sharing items since 2011. Oh, It's the strangest weather in the UK. It ranges between like, it'll be like 8 degrees in the morning and you're like, wow, damn, I'm freezing. And then it gets to 20 degrees and it's like that awkward thing where it's not like so warm, but it's like too warm to be wearing a fur jacket that you left the house in in the morning. Yeah. Next up we have this and this was my airport outfit top It's literally this plain tee and it says boy bye on the front because you know boy bye we ain't got No time for fuck boys 
I really like this. This is a really comfortable, plain chilling tee. My favorite thing is the folded over arms. Like I just find that look to be really flattering. It's the perfect length of arm for me. When I ordered this, I actually thought that it was gonna be quite a lot more oversized than it is, and I'd intended on wearing this as a t-shirt dress, but I would have needed to have gotten it in like a size large if I wanted to do that. I just had no idea what the sizing was going to be like. But it is just a plain chilling tee. Not too much to say about it. It's a good like material and yeah, I really like it. So the next thing is a set and I just need to find the bottoms of them. I think they could be down there somewhere. This is a matching camo track set which is so super cute. So this is the top. It's kind of just a like crop. It's almost like a, a sports bra style. It's not really like it's a little bit see-through. Like you can't see anything when you wear it, but it's not like the thickest material, just to bear in mind. And then it's got a like band at the bottom, like a stretchy band. The only thing is, is that this is too small for me. Um, it's just a little bit too tight around the arms. So that was a real pity. Like the bottoms still fit, but I would have preferred a size M. The waistband is super tight on both of the pieces. So a size medium would have been perfect for me in the set. So just bear that in mind. I would personally really suggest sizing up in this one because I'm normally a small and everything and yeah this just is a little bit too tight but I'm gonna give this a one away because there's nothing wrong with it it's super cute it's a nice material I really like the like muted kind of uh, pastel camouflage colors I feel like a lot of camouflage is in like quite like darker greens or more rich colors so I really love these pastel tones I think it's super cute and I'm really sad that it doesn't fit me but I do really like this the trousers are super cute I'm actually like I'm glad that they fit and I am still sad that they aren't exactly the right size they come high up on me and as you can see here it's stretchy but it's a very tight band so it almost allows it to stretch out far but once it goes back in it's very tight so when I was in Greece and I wore this on the plane and then like we stopped and had a lunch before we left and like, I was really full and it was <laughs> quite tight. Uh, my favorite thing about them is like they have these cute little cuffed bottoms and then they have these really big low down pockets. Like look how deep that pocket is. I thought that was really cool and not something that I had seen a lot. So I really, really like that. And I like the material of these. They feel like almost like pajama materials. They're not super thick. So it's not going to keep you like really warm in the winter, but they're super, super nice for just chilling. So that was everything that I got from Reb Dolls. I don't know about you guys, but I thought that the things were really good and I thought that they were really nice on a really affordable price and I thought that it kind of matched and exceeded my expectations. I hadn't ever heard of them before but I would definitely consider purchasing items on their website. Again, they are a US brand so I think that in terms of shipping, unless you spend, like a cert spend a certain amount of money, that you would get charged um, a shipping fee. I'll leave those details on the screen here. I don't know them off the top of my head. I really like the items. I hope that you guys did too. If you are not part of the Sab fam and you want to see more videos like this, don't forget to give this a big thumbs up and subscribe to be part of the family. If you don't want to miss any more videos, then you can click that little bell to be notified of when I put anything new out. I'm super excited. I've got some really different and fun content coming up and I just can't wait to share it all with you guys. Until next time, I love you guys so much. Bye!